Storm Team 2 forecast. And the forecast tonight, we have those showers and thunderstorms. They'll be moving into the area mainly after midnight. The northern counties first, close to midnight, 1 a.m., and then gradually spread south across the region. Most of the rain should be south of our area by about 5, 5.30 tomorrow morning. And then at 8 o'clock, look for a mostly cloudy sky, 59 degrees, just very low chances of some showers tomorrow morning, actually becoming mostly sunny. We'll see quite a bit of sunshine tomorrow afternoon and up into the low 70s. Severe thunderstorm warnings right along the Michigan, Indiana, Ohio borders up there tonight, extending over toward Lake Erie and uh, southeast of Chicago now in northwest Indiana. And then some severe thunderstorm warnings out along the Mississippi River and severe thunderstorm watch north of us tonight. That's in effect until 3 a.m. includes Salina and Wapkaneta, Mercer and Auglaize counties. But there's the active weather which is pushing south and southeast. You can see those stronger thunderstorms. We have not had any tornado warnings tonight. Uh, mostly here the main threats are strong damaging winds up around 60 miles per hour or some large hail. Even the potential for some hail up to around two inches in diameter with a cold front dropping south and southeast into the area here. That'll be the initial front coming through and then another one comes through tomorrow night with showers and even a few thunderstorms. So we'll stay upper 60s, low 70s over the next few hours. It'll take until we get the rain in here to start to cool things off and then dropping into the upper 50s, low 60s late tonight and then climbing back into the mid 60s tomorrow morning and then high temperatures tomorrow afternoon should make it up into the low to mid 70s. Look at even some of the upper 70s and low 80s uh, farther to the south, but you better enjoy those warm temperatures because it looks like below normal weather headed our way temperature wise here toward the end of the week. 52 Thursday, only around 50 on Friday, and then daytime highs over the weekend in the 50s, but even cooling off into the 40s next week, and there could even be some nighttime lows there dipping down below freezing. Troy Stouter Center camera, a mostly clear sky at sunset tonight, and we're still looking at dry weather up in Miami County. Duncan Oil Company camera right now, uh, 69 degrees, southwest wind at 12 miles per hour. The dew points there in the upper 50s, and of course those showers and thunderstorms, as we showed you there in northern Ohio. They'll continue to spread southward tonight, dropping on down uh, through Sydney, Bell Fountain, Urbana, Springfield, even the Dayton area around 3 a.m. And then you can see by the time we get to 5, 6 o'clock in the morning, most of the rain south of our viewing area, down into Butler, Warren, Clinton counties and moving away. And then we get back to more and more sunshine for tomorrow afternoon. Then tomorrow night, here we go again. More clouds moving in along with those showers and even a few thunderstorms. And those should move out by sunrise. Rise Thursday. Tonight, temperatures dropping slowly through the 60s at first and then cooling off into the upper 50s late night and the overnight low temperature around 58. Again, some of those storms coming through overnight could be severe. Could be some warnings come out for some strong winds or damaging hail and then partly to mostly sunny skies. Tomorrow looks like a pretty nice day with a high temperature of 73. Rain likely Wednesday night should move out by early Thursday. Thursday dry, windy but cooler, 52. 50 on Friday with partly sunny skies. Could be some frost Saturday morning and then 58. And it looks like some wet weather for Easter with high temperatures in the upper 50s.